So this essentially just ended our session. I've got a nice little puffy hand. We call that that end of the pipe, the hospital zone. And my smart self <laughs> grabbed the hospital zone. I think we'll be all right. We probably won't need to go to the hospital. So we got a color bar right here. I just split it in half. I used my little guillotine chopper. And so today we're gonna pull a simple white cane with this. Now, as you've seen in these videos before, most of the glass blowing that I do, I do it solo. I don't need an assistant and I'm very uh, comfortable with that process, but I am really excited when I get to blow glass with a partner. And today I've got the most special partner in the world coming. It is my father. A little dab of glass to pick up that color bar that's in there and we should be all right. Try not to turn too fast when I get into the fire because I'm taking this little piece of glass from that box at a thousand degrees and sticking it in two thousand degrees. If you do that too fast, if you're turning, for some reason it seems like it's much more likely to break or shatter. I'm actually pushing this onto the pipe. You want that connection of color to be as close to the pipe as possible. That way when you stretch it out, it stretches out very even. If you've got a, a section of clear in between, sometimes that clear can pull off faster. Within less than probably three seconds, it's moving and now it's moving at a very rapid pace so i'm just kind of i'm not even giving it full turns i can almost lift it off the marver but it's super hot so it's a little more comfortable to just leave it on the marver and in that last five seconds it's hardened up to where you know it's not moving nearly as fast that's easy to keep on center and not kind of turn the color bar that's inside you know, the more it kind of flops up and down, the more that area is gonna get uh, twisted and tangled. And with cane, the more even it is, typically the better. I love doing this. I've done this, I can't tell you how many times, thousands of times. For some reason, it never gets boring. And you know, this is the most simple of all canes. Just a little color range. You ready to do this, Pops? Oh yeah. Bring it up. to draw off of the pipe depending upon the angle that I hold this. If it's flowing a lot, I lift it up. If it's not flowing much, I hold it down and that draws the cane off of the pipe. The coldness of the steel. that simple white cane up to create more canes which are going to be twisted. Canes. 